Hey guys, it's Lena from the Land of Gods and we are doing the monthly map spread for the sign of Aquarius, my aqua baby, sun, moon, rising and Venus. This is for the month of October. Guys, please remember time is fluid. These are general readings. Cards sometimes pick up your energy or somebody that is on your mind, your loved one. So please take what resonates and leave the rest for others to receive. And I am sorry for the frog in my throat that you can hear right now. I'm down with some viral and uh, cough and cold. But a friend of mine told me, go for it, Lena. Keep the readings going. So she definitely inspired me. And here I am with my frog voice. So excuse me for that. Apologies already if I land up coughing in the middle of the reading if you are here for the first time welcome aboard welcome to my channel and if you've been kind enough to come back thank you so very much guys welcome back let us go aquas what are we starting with am i holding it no upside down oh okay so what are we starting with oh look at that we are starting oh wow we are starting with beautiful energies here. Ten of Cups and Strength. Wow, look at you. Family is somehow in focus. That's giving you strength. Either you have family, a young family, I see. Or you're working to have a family. And there's a lot of effort being put into that. To make things beautiful to make things fulfilling why such an extra effort being put in is my question i don't know ace of swords something has come very crystal clear to you now whether it is i know i want a family like you know some people are not sure when they are in a relationship, whether they would want a kid or not. I definitely see a very loving couple right here with kids right there playing. So it could be that. Or coming to this point to say, yes, I want it. Took a lot of, you know, inner strength. Let's, let's get more. I feel there is more to this than just that. Let's get more. There's some clarity definitely coming in. Why is so much of strength needed? Spirit, give me some more for the strength side. What is it? Yeah, look. There's been a time of time out. There's been a time of time out. You were healing from something. Aquas, you were healing from something. Wow, it's like unfolding of something in the reverse <laughs> it feels like you are going to reach there but how is what is getting now unfolded in front of me king of wands wow lots of fire here are you involved with the fire sign Ooh, lovers look i'm telling you there is this connection which now you are very clear with that you want it Probably you did not know because you were dealing with something. Ace of Wands and you want this new beginning with them. You want kids, who knows. You want a family with them, let's put it that way. You and them together itself is family. But I feel that for some, some people do, do want family. You are determined. It's taken quite a while for you to come here, to reach this spot. There's a lot of passion, but there's a lot of confusion as well. Why confused? Why confused? Oh, Aquas, you are taking me everywhere right now for a full-on trip. There is clarity you want it, but you still are not sure. What are you not sure of? We'll see when the, when the clarifiers come up. Let's first close the circle. Hierophant. Hmm. 
you might want to talk to a friend or somebody elder to you to gain a better view or you learn through things this could be your higher self as well trying to connect with you tell you seven of swords that you are fooling yourself by letting go of something which is so clear right in front of you is what i hear it's all in front of you you know what you want heart in heart there is a lot of passion there is a lot of connection there's a lot of bonding you know exactly what you want it has taken you a, a, a long long time and it has taken a lot of inner strength to reach where you have reached so why are you unnecessarily questioning this all yeah devil is this all a game i hear knight of swords but that's a fast moving energy right there are you thinking that it's all a game because it was all so fast after having that mental clarity that you wanted things moved faster than expected let us clarify this is very interesting like i see someone who's clear yet unclear like not ready to acknowledge what energetically he or she has already acknowledged you know what i mean there is a lot of passion here but you are questioning this is it all a game it's coming back again and again is it all a game for you ten of cups ten of cups please clarify the ten of cups spirit this one Ooh, high priestess look that's what i'm saying your intuition is telling you that you gotta go for that your intuition is nudging you towards that you you are intuitively inclined towards having this family now whether it is just the two of you or whether it is you know family or not that's for you to decide there are some people who i feel are at different stages of this relationship growth and you know there's something that's taken my attention that's grabbed my attention you see that endless knot of strength of energy right here look at that i've never seen that i swear never seen this knot right here it's taken a long long time for you to have that clarity then why are you ambushing yourself i feel it's like it's lots of self sabotage self self doubt as well let's go where should i head to okay i haven't had the answer where should i head to okay here <clears throat> knight of swords coming this time in the reverse so that's what i'm saying you are torn you are torn you have that clarity but you know a part of you wants to go for it a part of you is like no 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 no, no. let's just be let's just make sure that this is not another game that life is playing with me Ooh. Ooh. Strength. Let's go to strength. No, I'm told go to lovers. Okay, I'm gonna go to lovers. Look, it's coming out of the blue. I understand why you would be like, you know, a little um, surprised or taken aback because it's not what you were expecting you were not you are not sure whether you should take this cup or not well a part of you is sure that you should take this cup because this cup has presented itself in the most gorgeous glorious divine way but a part of you is like wait a minute this could be a trick yeah your mind is playing games with you Ooh, now we can go to strength <coughs> 
five of swords. Listen, as I said, there was a conf. There is something that you have come out from that you have survived. That conflict that was there from which you have recovered. Have you recovered fully? Has your heart recovered fully? There is some part of it that does not seem to be. It seemed to be still confused. That's the part that is leading to this confusion and self-sabotage. Four of swords. Two of swords. Look, that's what I'm saying. You have recovered from something. But whatever that is right now in front of you, your mind, your active mind is standing there as that big why. Are you sure? Is this a game? Like the skeptic in you is not letting you accept what you have already accepted energetically, your subconscious, your, your, uh, you know, inner self has already accepted this but your conscious self you know your active brain is telling you to check again recheck again you know even though you know that you have checked it a multiple you know times a hundred times it is what it is it's like you know some people because of some kind of impulse that they have or something that has gone wrong in the past like this time I want to make sure that it's perfect so is this like 10 rows with eight strings like with different beats check it again and again and again it's just yeah I, I feel hysteria of some level there ace of wands spirit what is this ace of wands lovers is coming in oh my god look at that yes it's a very passionate beginning that has you know, come from God only knows where and you are like swooped off your feet completely, completely. Wow, Aquas. This is a very strong bond I feel for you guys. Dang. What is this king of fire doing here the king of wands what is this king of wands doing oh my god it's four of wands right here guys oh my god oh it's the battle between the conscious and the subconscious it, the, it's a battle between what your heart wants and what your logical brain is telling you what a battle to be stuck in oh my god but it's it's worth it i feel it the connection is so beautiful i see it taking you to that ten of cups because there's so much of passion passion is there it is something that can go long term guys knight of cups with the fool are you ready to take that leap of faith? It all comes down to taking that leap of faith. Do you have faith in this? Do you have faith in life? Do you have faith in yourself that this time around it's not going to be like before? Because you are not the same. Because you have learned. Have you learned it is the question now. The Hierophant. The Hierophant spirit. Queen of Pentacles, have you gained your grounding? Do you have that sense of control over your life in general? Do you feel that you have gained the knowledge, the wisdom that you should have from which you recovered? Have you completely understood why what happened in your life happened? I feel there is somebody with a victim mentality here who's like, I don't know why it happened. I don't know why, you know, this crap happened or I don't know why I have this kind of, you know, 
brother or I don't know why I have this kind of father or I don't know why I have this kind of, you know, uh, lover earlier or, or wife or whosoever. I'm just some connection which is way, way close to you has got you to a point where you had to take a time out and and uh, recover from something okay that pain and all is in the past it, it, that happened yes <laughs> that happened aquas uh, you dealt with it uh, you are now kind of you know you have dealt with that pain you are now in the next phase of healing so now something new is coming up and there is shards of that past energy that is now acting like thorns in your path. That's what's leaving you confused. Seven of Cups, Spirit. Please clarify Seven of Cups. Look at that. We have the Ace of Wands and the Moon. You are not sure about where it's leading. There is that Ace of Wands again coming up in reverse. This is your active brain talking to you and leaving you confused because you do not know where it's heading. There is no surety in life anyhow. Aquas. Today you sit in the car, you just take the turn, boom, you're gone. Or some loved one is gone. What are you going to do? You're not going to ever step out of your, your apartment? anywhere you're not gonna go anywhere like seriously is that what we are now doing to ourselves we're not gonna do anything new we're not gonna trust in ourselves at all because we do not know where it's heading because emotions are clearly there a lot of them i see a lot of passion here and promise too but there's nothing guaranteed in life it is what it is so take it or leave it you are the one who has to take that leap of faith seven of swords yeah this is that confusion that active brain those uh you know as i was saying those thorns in your path that you have led by the way nine of pentacles because part of you is like i'm better off just by myself dude I do not want to deal with this heartache again or whatever. Ten of Cups is coming up again. Tower, it's going to come. It's going to come to you and you, you're, you're, you're like, I do not know what to do. I do not know what to do. I want this, but I don't know. I do not want to go through this tower moment again. You are scared. You're scared to be happy again. You're scared to be happy. Devil, I see the Queen of Cups here. Yeah, somebody has definitely taken your heart, like swooped you off the ground. You know you want it, but there are some other energies or energies from the past or feelings from the past that you are um, recovering from. But I feel the lesson is still somehow missing a bit. It's not that you have not learned anything, but there's something very very important and that is do not lose faith in love my loves just because someone landed up hurting you bad devil please clarify devil devil is clarified by the sun oh my god yeah and emperor look yeah this is long term. This is full of passion. I feel zero negative vibe from this devil. This is really very luring energy, yes, but not negative energy. It's it's a it's a lot of connection, the bond. There's a lot of sensuality here. There's a lot of happiness here. Look, sun and ten of cups. You feel connected so well blended together and yet you are the one who's messing uh, this up in your head your brain is messing this up for you you are thinking way from that you know 
I need to think from all perspective. Yes, you do. But in the matter of heart, not always can you be standing in that emperor's um, energy, you know. You got to allow your heart to feel what it is feeling. And I feel that your self, yeah, like your inner self has any which ways done that. It's your active brain. It's your conscious mind that is fighting it, fighting it. You're fighting with yourself. My God, fighting with yourself, Equus. Because somebody is bringing in so much of happiness. <laughs> you're fighting happiness? Seriously, you're fighting love? You're fighting attraction? You're fighting bond? What are you fighting? Do you have the faith? Can you take that leap? You need to ask yourself these questions. Aquas. Let us get you an oracle guidance message to wrap up this reading. Lots of love here. Lots of love here. Whoa, look at that. Community. Connect with your people, I feel. Maybe they'll be able to help you gain that answer that you want or let you relax for a bit. Take a chill pill. Connect with your peeps. Okay, let's see what the card actually says. Connection with kindred spirits. This card shows three women celebrating, sharing ideas and a supportive energy. The lights in the picture represents your ever-present spirit community as well. When this card appears upright, it indicates an association of some kind. It may be a casual connection of like-minded people joining a club or community of sort or even a business partnership consisting of three or more entities. The time is right to make such new connections and to share intentions, whether they are personal or professional. Networking and community are important parts of human experience, and the security and the sense of connection can be beneficial to all. It's true that when several people join their intention, it accelerates their power in the energetic realm. Receiving this card puts you on notice that the universe is sending some beneficial alliance your way. Like the happy family card, this could also indicate a party or celebration of some kind. Well, I feel that you need to go and get in touch with your people, your friends, your family, those with whom you can, you know, be open and upright about things and discuss whatever that you need to and hopefully they'll be able to clear up some of this confusion but at the end of the day it is you who need to learn from the past and who need to still have faith in love and take that step forward and on that note my aquas i'm gonna take your leave i thank you all for joining me it's a wrap namaste from the land of gods